kitchen now. And this is a part of the segment that I've really been looking forward to. I'm a huge tea fanatic. So what are we going to be doing today? So today we'll be brewing a Taya, and that's a Gambian tea. Um, they drink it all the time over there. So we have all the ingredients here to make it. We've got the, the tea leaves themselves. We've got the cups which you drink out of, but also are used to in the process of making it for measurements and things. Um, you have the tea kettle itself, you have some sugar here, and you have water here. And uh, that's everything we'll need to make some good tasting tea. Right. Now I noticed we're going to be using gunpowder here. Yes. What, uh, what's with the name? Uh, well, that's the name of the tea leaf, Special Gunpowder. I think that's just because it's really strong. I, last time I checked, it wasn't very flammable or explosive, so we should be safe. <laughs> All right, sounds good, and uh, I like my tea potent, so uh, let's use it and get going. All right, sounds good. So step one, we'll be adding three and a half glasses full of water to the teapot. So now step two, once we've got the water in the kettle, we just put the kettle on the stove and just wait for it to boil. But in the meantime, we can uh, measure out a, uh, a cup of the tea and... Uh, so we can add it once the water boils. So. Right. so now that the uh, water is boiling, we can go ahead and add the tea leaves. So I'll let you add them. I'll open it up for you. And so now you can see it's boiling again, so we can uh, go ahead and add the sugar. So now what we do to mix it up, because there's still some sugar left on the bottom there. Yep. So we'll just pour some out and then pour that back into the top. Gambia, when do uh, people come together to drink the tea? Well, typically late afternoon, but you can really brew it at all times, whenever you're craving it, really. All right, so now you see it's boiled after we've added the sugar. So what we're going to do is we're going to pour some tea into this glass, and then we're going to cool it off, and that's, the, uh, that's one of the final steps. So let's do that now. We've got some uh, cold water here so I can cool off my fingers when I'm mixing this, because this gets pretty hot. So. We just... And uh, what's the reasoning behind this? This helps cool it off, and also you'll see the bubbles start to get bigger and bigger if I do it correctly. And uh, they really like that. They like, the, they like a, lot of, a lot of bubbles, a lot of head to their, uh, to their tea, so. That's about ready to uh, ready to drink. What's awesome. The, That's the part I've been waiting for. So, is there any uh, special uh, way to drink this? Just cheers. Cheers. Very sweet. Yeah. <laughs> but I like it. It's very good. been delicious, John. I want to thank you again uh, for taking us through the tea process, of giving a little uh, insight on uh, some of the lifestyle in the Gambia. And thanks again for joining us, and it's been a pleasure. My pleasure. Thanks.